Welcome back guys to another video. We are going to be using the Vosk Pro with Legion Armor. This should probably be the best strafing experience ever because as you all guys know the Vosk has the same ability as a pistol and Legion Armor offers more speed in close range battle so this really should be epic. And of course you also, wow, okay. Well kinda, okay, this might not be the best strafing experience but still something. This noob down here. I know some reason an MC5 camping does not. Wow, what the? Oh, that guy's gonna be killing us constantly. I can already tell. But um, for some reason MC5 is not the game to camp on. Like, if you ever notice, this game is not a good camping game. But I don't know what. Maybe they made the maps perfectly non-campable, or what. But there are no, there's no camping in this game. Like, decent cam where you just won't get killed immediately right after. I guess because there's stuff like recon and all those other things. Okay, anybody else? And I also have a lot more pro guns. I've came into a recently large supply of elite packs. And I have the, um, the Railgun Pro, which I'm definitely going to make a video on. So hopefully you guys will see that in the near future. And I know I have not been making a lot of videos lately, I've had a lot. And when I say a lot, I mean a lot of homework. A really a lot of homework. Probably the most homework I've ever had. Oh, this year. Definitely this whole year. But I guess it's mostly because I missed two days of school. And all the work that I missed for those two days I am getting now, why I'm also having a whole bunch of homework. Which sucks. I have a paper to write. But notice when I write these papers, I just make up crap. Like you have to have a certain amount of words. I just like ramble on about stuff, just random stuff, and make it sound legit, and get those two thousand word papers out. Oh, okay, that's gonna kill me. Oh, that didn't kill me. Okay. This dude. I cannot. I could never find a good camo for the boss. It's just that because so much of the gun shows and the gun is black, it just a lot of camos can't fit it properly. But I think this was the best camo that I have to fit it. And I do have all the camos except the, the top two VIP camos, which is the blue one and the old black one with little lines and stuff. Which are my two favorite camos, and I'm really mad that they make the, the really coolest camos in the game. You have to pay such a large sum of money to get it. Like, who is going to pay $1,300? to get a camo. I'm pretty sure somebody could actually create some type of hack that would make your gun look as if it had the camo or something like that. But that price is ridiculous for a camo I want so much. But I'll definitely never spend that much money for it on this game. Hopefully I don't. Well, if I was a millionaire, I might think about it. But just for principal reasons, I probably wouldn't. This gun is really good close range. And because the pro has more damage, it's almost, it's almost as good as the boss in close range. Almost as good. This gun still sucks though. It's still fun to use. That's what I love about these bounty hunter guns. They're not overpowered, except the tier 7, but, but they are fun to use. They're all different. They're, none of them are the same, except the um, AAR. It's probably the only one that's a little, um, like all the other guns. It's dude. You're doing good this game. It's been really hard to find a game with a lot of people. I guess people are actually stopped playing this game. Because it's really hard to find, like, decent sized games. The biggest game I found had, like, five people. Okay, this E24 guy is gonna. Wow. That was a mistake that we made. <laughs> we ran in between a gunfight with two people that had KOGs. Okay, we have a minute left. I think, no, we could not hit 30. I'm like 100% sure. Like, we couldn't even run that fast if, if we even killed every single person. This KOG, people. Stop, stop tryharding. Like, throw a silencer on it or something. Which I actually did. I used this, I was using a KOG with a silencer the other day. And it was, it was pretty OP. <laughs> it's actually good, really good. Probably one of the best guns to throw a silencer onto. Okay, 21. Okay, no, no, no. Wow. I was past the wall. I hate the lag in this game. It's ridiculous. Of 
could throw an impact. I don't feel like getting him. I know. I'm a noob. Come on, you need to die before I die. Okay, yep, yep, they're, they're coming, they're coming, they're coming. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, uh, come on. Somebody distract them. <laughs> I was just hoping somebody would, like, come to my rescue and just, like, start shooting him or something, but I guess. I'm out of luck. Well, guys, I hope you liked the video, and if you really care, guys, please subscribe. Maybe leave a like. Let's try to hit five likes, and maybe at least hit three dislikes. That'll make me very happy. I need to get those three dislikes. That, that's what gets me those views. They see three dislikes, they're like, hmm, how could an MC5 video suck? Gotta watch this. So please leave some dislikes, leave some likes, leave some comments, leave some money, whatever you want. Maybe leave some nudes, anything. Subscribe. Peace.